Imagine, if you will, the ability to traverse time, to witness the rise and fall of civilizations, or to glimpse the far-flung future. Time travel has always been a captivating concept, hasn't it? The allure of time travel has long held a magnetic pull over our imaginations, its tantalizing possibilities igniting our curiosity. After all, who among us hasn't daydreamed of journeying to the past to witness history's pivotal moments, or of venturing into the future to see what technological marvels await? This fascination isn't confined to idle musings. It's been the lifeblood of countless science fiction narratives, from H.G. Wells' The Time Machine to the temporal escapades of Doctor Who. These stories, and many others, have explored the potential consequences, both thrilling and terrifying, of meddling with the time-space continuum. But the concept of time travel isn't purely the domain of speculative fiction. In the realm of science, it's a topic of serious debate and investigation. Einstein's theory of relativity, for instance, suggests that time is not a constant, but a variable, which can be manipulated under the right conditions. Theoretical physicists have posited the existence of wormholes, tunnel-like structures in the fabric of space-time that could, theoretically, serve as shortcuts between different points in time. Though these theories remain unproven, they provide a tantalizing hint at the potential reality of time travel. Yet, as we stand on the precipice of the unknown, we ask, could there already be proof of this incredible concept? Could there be tangible evidence that time travel not only exists, but has already occurred? In our quest for answers, we turn to an unexpected source, historical photographs. These captured moments in time, innocent in their intent, may hold within them anomalies that defy explanation. Anachronistic details that suggest the presence of individuals or objects that simply should not exist in the time period they appear. But what if we told you there were photos that might just prove time travel is more than just a figment of our collective imaginations? Our first photographic evidence comes from the 1940s, and it might just leave you scratching your heads in disbelief. Now, imagine the scene. It's the mid-20th century, and we're at the reopening of the South Fork Bridge in Canada. The crowd is buzzing with excitement, people are dressed in their best, and cameras are flashing. But among the sea of fedoras, suits, and dresses, one man stands out. He's not dressed like the others. He's wearing a printed t-shirt, sunglasses, and what looks like a modern-day hoodie. Even his hairstyle, a slicked-back modern do, seems out of place in this sea of 1940s fashion. But it's not just his attire that's causing a stir. In his hands, he's holding a camera that seems too compact and streamlined for the era. It's more akin to a design you'd expect to see 20, 30, or even 40 years later. This man, this mysterious hipster, seems to be an anachronism, a piece of the future inexplicably present in the past. The theories surrounding this man are as varied as they are intriguing. Some suggest he's a time traveler, a man from our era, or perhaps even the future, who has somehow journeyed back to the 1940s. Others propose he's proof of a parallel universe, where technology advanced at a far quicker pace. And still, others think he might be an extraterrestrial, visiting us from a far-off world. But of course, skeptics abound. They argue that his clothes could be explained away as being ahead of the fashion curve, or perhaps he was simply a trendsetter. As for the camera, it could just be a particularly advanced model of the time, or a prototype not yet available to the general public. So what do you think? Is this man a genuine time traveler, caught on film? Could he be a visitor from another reality, or even an alien tourist? Or is there a more prosaic explanation for his appearance and technology? Could this man really be a time traveler, or is there a more mundane explanation? You decide. Fast forward to the 1920s, and we have another perplexing image that might just make you question your grip on reality. Imagine the scene. The year is 1928, and Charlie Chaplin's The Circus is playing on the silver screen. A crowd of people are milling about, decked out in the styles of the era. But there, in the midst of the crowd, something stands out. A woman, holding what appears to be a cell phone. Yes, you heard that right, a cell phone, decades before they were even a glimmer in the eye of technology. This seeming anachronism has sparked a flurry of speculation and debate. Could this woman be a time traveler, casually chatting away on her mobile, 
in an era where such a device would be seen as nothing short of miraculous? Is she, perhaps, an emissary from the future, caught on film in a moment of carelessness? The theories are as varied as they are fascinating. Some argue that she's using a device from the future to communicate with her time-traveling counterparts. Others suggest she might be a visitor from another dimension where technology advanced at a different pace. The possibilities are truly mind-bending, and it's easy to get lost in the rabbit hole of speculation. But wait, before we get too carried away, let's consider the counter-arguments. Skeptics insist that the woman is simply using a hearing aid, which were indeed available in the 1920s. Others postulate that she might be holding a portable radio receiver. These explanations, while less sensational, do offer a more grounded perspective. The image of the cell phone lady, as she's come to be known, is a puzzle that continues to intrigue. Is she a time traveler, a visitor from another world, or just a woman of her time, captured in a moment that seems extraordinary to our modern eyes? So, is this woman a time traveler caught on film, or is there a simpler explanation? We'll let you be the judge. Now, let's travel back in time to the 16th century, where something rather peculiar seems to have been captured in a well-known church. In this trip down the annals of history, we encounter a curious piece of art, a painting known as the Madonna with Saint Giovannino. At first glance, it appears to be just another religious painting, but upon closer inspection, something out of place appears. Hovering in the sky behind the Virgin Mary, a figure that bears an uncanny resemblance to a modern astronaut can be seen. Yes, you heard it right, an astronaut in a 16th century painting. It's as baffling as it sounds. This figure, complete with what seems to be a helmet and suit, has sparked a flurry of theories among time travel enthusiasts. Could it be that an astronaut from the future somehow found their way back to the 16th century? Did they leave an indelible mark on the artist and leading him to include this figure in his painting? But before we get carried away with these fascinating theories, let's consider the counter-arguments. Art critics and historians argue that the astronaut may simply be a case of symbolism, a common practice in religious art of the time. They suggest that the figure could represent a divine message coming from the heavens symbolized by the suit and helmet that resemble an astronaut's gear. Or, perhaps, it's a depiction of an angel, an entity often associated with the sky and the heavens. These counter-arguments remind us to tread carefully when interpreting historical artifacts. They also highlight the beauty and complexity of art, where a single image can give rise to multiple interpretations. Yet, the uncanny resemblance of the figure to a modern astronaut keeps the time travel theory alive, it's a tantalizing thought, isn't it? An astronaut from the future, wandering the streets of 16th century Italy, forever immortalized in a painting. Could this really be an astronaut from the future, or is it just a case of misinterpreted symbolism? It's up to you to decide. Time travel is a concept that continues to captivate us, and these photos certainly add fuel to the fire of speculation. We've taken a deep dive into the enigma of time travel, a concept that has been a topic of fascination for scientists, philosophers, and sci-fi enthusiasts alike for centuries. We journeyed back in time with the mysterious hipster, a man seemingly out of sync with his era, his fashion and technology starkly contrasting the world around him. His anomalous presence in a photo from the 40s stirs our curiosity and nudges us to ponder on the possibilities of time travel. We then moved on to the cell phone lady, that enigmatic figure from the 20s, clutching what appears to be a device decades ahead of its time. An optical illusion, a misinterpretation, or a time traveler lost in time. The debate continues. We also ventured into the cosmos with the modern astronaut, a figure spotted in a cathedral built hundreds of years before the dawn of space exploration. An artist's prophetic vision, or a time traveling astronaut leaving his mark in the past, the mystery deepens. While these photos are intriguing, they are not definitive proof of time travel. They are, however, food for thought, sparks for our imaginations, and catalysts for our curiosity. They challenge our perceptions of reality and invite us to question, to explore, and to wonder. Time travel, as a concept, is a labyrinth of paradoxes and possibilities. It's a journey into the unknown, a dive into the depths of the human imagination. 
Whether it is fact or fiction is a question yet unanswered. But one thing is certain, it never fails to ignite our imaginations. Whether time travel is fact or fiction, it's a concept that never fails to ignite our imaginations. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell to stay updated on our latest content. Until next time, keep questioning the world around you.